how do you become a reliability engineer? What's the most common career path to becoming a reliability engineer? <laughs> you apply for a job and uh, somebody gives you a title <laughs> and you're thrown into the fire and you're like, okay, so what's this uh, reliability <laughs> thing? Um, <laughs> I think that's how most of us got into it. I've heard of some companies, they have a reliability training program. Generally, you come from a a maintenance background or you're a mechanical engineer. I myself am a materials engineer, which deals with a lot of uh, failure analysis and stuff like that. So it's a nice fit in that capacity. But to become truly become a reliability engineer, you need to do a lot of learning. You need to obviously listen to the content that you and um, other podcast providers put out there. You need to do a lot of reading. There's a lot of great books on reliability. You just need to go through and understand what the, the math and resources are, is that are available. And there's different certifications out there. I know SMRP has the CMRP, which is a great validation of knowledge. Um, it doesn't prove that you have knowledge. I, you know, my idea of certifications are they're a good validation, but you don't need it to actually prove that you can do a job. Your work should be able to speak to that yourself. But if you're looking for a new job and want to be in reliability, those certifications obviously help prove to potential employers that you understand reliability. So essentially what I'm hearing, Steve, is, you know, you just, you take a shot, you apply for that job, you throw yourself into the deep end and you learn. Uh, it sounds like that's kind of the most common jump into the, the space of reliability. <laughs> Which is, it's so ironic considering the job of reliability is to have, you know, that forethought and understanding for total asset life cycles and total cost of ownership and understanding those concepts, yet we all just kind of jump into it head first and, and sink or swim more or less. 